Yo, hello my people, this is Zomek, and we're watching another horror movie. I'm doing a combination that I haven't done in some time. First thing, we're watching a horror movie. Last time I watched a horror movie, it was called The Den. It was an okay movie. Um, but I don't think I was drinking any alcohol during that. Yeah, so we're kind of back to OG um horror movie reaction thing where i'm drinking beer or something else you know something with alcohol in it and we're watching a horror movie last time i did that was with uh, um with movie called host it was not a bad movie it was okay <laughs> um okay but yeah this time i'm doing a movie from france called ills but in english it's them I don't know anything about this movie. It had good ratings. It's from 2006. It looks like it could be scary, but I don't know anything. So, yeah, there's that. Um, I'm thinking, when was the last time where I watched a movie that I was very scared of? I don't think I watched anything like this on the channel. I'm thinking about Host, but I don't... No, host was somewhere there, but not really at the spot where I'm like, oh my god, I'm so scared. I don't remember. I wish... I don't. I don't. It doesn't matter. Thing is, this one looks interesting. Never seen it. You probably guys all seen it before because you're watching this reaction. If you haven't, well, thank you. Thank you for doing this with me. I mean, thank you. Anyway, it doesn't matter if you've seen it or not. So, yeah, enough of the intro. Um, so if you want to watch my movie reactions early, with TV shows it's different, sometimes you can see them early, sometimes not, so I won't even talk about that, but if you want to watch my movie reactions early and watch full reactions, there's a link to my Patreon below, check it out, you can do all that there, at least a few days early, at least three days early, but it could be like a week early, it depends on the movie. Okay, enough talking, it's been two minutes, I love it. Two minutes for talking is the best. Now let's start. I'm not drinking anything strong. I'm just drinking some cider, sparkling, you know, it's still alcohol and some beer. That's it. Lights are off. It's raining outside. And it's 12 a.m. So it's awesome. The story is based on real events in Romania. I love it. That's it. I love this movie already. <laughs> Did we see who it was? I think I've seen something, but it looked like a person, like a human. That's something that I saw. Maybe it was nothing, maybe it was just a tree. <laughs> I wonder what kind of horror movie is this? Is it like some monster in the woods? Some deranged people killing? Maybe anim no. I don't know. At least you have your phones. If if they were. What? What was that sound? Oh. That sound was very, it was like, <coughs> and that's it. She's gone. Oh, it's, oh yeah, it's Romania. Yeah, so it's Romanian language. Never been in Romania, not even close. It's made by French people. They, they, they make crazy stuff sometimes. Mama. She's long gone. Mama. I think she gets it that her mom is gone and she's not coming back. Oh shit. Wait, could it be that her mother had the car keys? That looks like shit. I don't know, it doesn't feel like it's humans. 
You can't even see them. So it might be human because he's strangling me hard. Movie is called Vem, so yeah, you know, there's more than one. I hope it's not that scary. It's, I mean, sc I hope it's scary, but not super scary. Because I mean, I'll have to go to sleep. Now we're in France. Same year. College. The Bucharest? Oh, French College in Bucharest. And Bucharest is the capital of Romania. Oh. It means go good day, goodbye. It's hard to live in a foreign country. At least at first. Especially if you don't know the language. I remember having hard moments when I lived in Poland alone. It's like in almost every other horror movie. You know, first we see an intro where some random people are getting killed. And after they die, only then we cut to, um, to our main character. That's a cool building. <gasps> Tuborg! I drank Tuborg last week. <laughs> oh, that's the same car. Did we find the feces on the windows? House out of town. Surrounded by forest. No other houses around. Yeah, we're watching a horror movie. There is no way she lives in this house alone. Maybe there's whole family there. <laughs> that sound! I've heard that sound so many times in horror games. Is it her husband playing video games? <laughs> oh, it's this legendary game 3D Space Cadet. I remember it from Windows XP. <laughs> He is always working, even if he's working on you, he's also working on his book. Whoa, maybe not now. <laughs> You're not allowed to have this much fun. You're too old for the. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Hello? Now what I want the most is an explanation. Why are we living why do we live in this place? How do we get this place? Is that pornography by watching? We what we have dog? Doggy? If that is his dog, why would he be calling it doggy? Nope, I don't think that's his dog. Why would you be living in this place? It's just creepy. Who's that? In the middle of the night. Wait, we could be calling into this lion phone. Hello. Okay. Oh, we must have got the wrong number. <clears throat> That's me. <coughs> I mean, it's not like we're in a horror movie or anything. Yeah, that call is it's the beginning of something very, very bad. Often when you watch some crappy horror movie, after a scary part you get to see some breasts. This doesn't look like one of those movies. It's slow, but we're getting there. That call... Yeah, that call was important. It changed 
stuff a bit. I think we're here. Whoever it is. Them. Eels. We're here. There's some... There's some kind of sounds outside. It's 3.46. So she slept for two hours. Wait, how come there are lights? Like in front of them? Did she turn them on before? Wait, where was her car before? If her car moved somehow, you know it's not a good idea to go outside. I wouldn't walk any further unless I had something like flashlight. Just run! And the car is gone. T'as vraiment pas les papiers? No. Non, la veine. Dans la halte rebouillée, il existe ou alta sur route chez nous? Laisse tomber, on s'en fout très mal. Pour nous, mais les propriétaires. Oh shit, I forgot to turn off the sound. Yes, I'll do it in five seconds. They cut my wires or something. Stop it! Get some help. Oh shit, they're in the house. But aren't they in the house? Maybe they're not. Guys, you're stuck in this house. It's not, it doesn't look good. They're coming. I mean, it's obvious that we're gonna get in the house. That's easy for them. I think we're gonna murder the dog. Yeah, they did something to the dog. I mean, you can't hide. Unless we came just to steal your stuff. Why have uh, lights back? And you have nothing to, to defend yourself with. Your only defense is doors, door locks. But by going out, you're losing that only way of defending yourself. I know it's not as easy in Romania to get a gun as in like let's say USA, but still, just find a way, because you're going to need it. What is he going to do? Is he just going to say, come at me, bro, with his first song? How is he not scared? Oh, wait, he has a weapon. Okay. Are you telling me they are behind this bar? Why would they? Why would they be here? Oh, I think you're gonna get hit from behind. It must be a trap. Yep. Oh, sh Okay, oh, that was the worst. That's like the worst thing I've seen in this movie as of right now. Ah! 
Somebody that we haven't seen yet trying to open the doors. Oh my god! There is no there is no doorknob, she can't. Wait, maybe she can actually. Stabbed. Yeah, slowest movie ever just turned up the volume. Literally. <laughs> he needs to bite into something, maybe? Can you knock it down? Can you kick out the door with this lock? Maybe. Please tell me that this movie is gonna explain at least something about them. Okay, you have a window. Wait, is one of them here? How? Oh, there's other way to get here? No, don't stop. What was that song? What is that sound? It's like he's binding up something. Like you know that box where a clown comes out. Wait, he has a machete? What was that? Oh... Shit. Wait... He's dead. Did she just use her fists? He was standing like this. He was standing like this and when she... Use her fist and he just... What? Lucas, I killed one! But if there's like still three of them left, well... It's bad. Only option is to hide, I guess. I have no idea where are we going. I mean, where car is going, so... But where are you gonna run? What was that light? Are we coming? Very crazy. Is that them making those sounds? No. He can't climb it with his leg. I feel like this is goodbye for Lucas. Yeah, but you can't stay here, because if you stay here, you're just gonna die. So yeah, 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 yeah. Hiding is a good idea. Yeah, we're coming. At least two of them. Maybe there's two left. I mean, it's possible. <coughs> Even birds are on their side.
There is no way keys are in the car. What is that sound we're making? Are we winding up some jack in a box or what? Nope, car is just there, we barely moved. If that's the same car. He didn't hear Lucas coming. It's just some teenagers. Please move it by the end of by the by the time you end Please tell me why are we doing this? That mother and daughter were killed nearby, so maybe they have a base somewhere around here. They're still doing something to Clem. It sounds like they're torturing her or raping her. Are we using electricity? Because it it sounds like like taser wood. Oh, that was a little kid's voice. What? He just puts her mouth in a bag. But why? And are there other kids? And why? I have in here. I have even more questions now. Hey, it's those. It's many kids just living here in the sewers. But why? Oh shit! Look, it's getting beat up. Oh shit! That. He's still alive, but... Yeah, not anymore. I knew it was a trick. I knew it. Why would they believe some random kid who was with those other kids that attacked them? I have so many questions. And I don't know if we have enough time. No, hit, hit, hit. Oh no, you saw what he did to Lucas. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Because I'm sure they killed a lot of people and they are going to kill Lucas too. There's somebody waiting for you. Oh, it's not, but she can't get out. Uh. Is that the end of Clementine and Lucas? Maybe we'll see something that is gonna explain to us why was this whole thing happening? Oh, it's that toy! You asshole! I'll kill you for using that toy in this whole movie. <laughs> so that's how they spend their weekends? What? So... Most of the days we go to school with normal kids, but when weekend comes, oh, we go to live in sewers and kill people. Monica, shut up! Five events, the boys comment on and Lucas made they were found. Five days later. By the police. Okay. After the investigation, the murderers were arrested in the Snago region. They were between the age of 10 and 15. Okay, that, that stuff I got, but now, what I didn't know is, during the first interrogation, the youngest amongst them declared... Declared what? Declared... Declared what? 
You can't then move it like this. What did you declare? What? Wait, wait, wait. So he said this. This doesn't explain anything. Because I don't understand. I don't know what this means. Ills. Ills means them. That's all I know. I I need to know what that sentence means. I can just unmove it like that. So is that it? So what did he declare? That's it. What? So, every single thing was translated except for the last sentence? What? What did he declare? Why was that the only thing? That was so important to me. Guys, you don't have to tell me what... What did he mean in that last sentence? What did he say in that last sentence of a movie? I'll Google it after I finish this reaction. If you've never seen this movie and you're watching this with me for the first time, you Google that too. Just stop on that moment where I stop. Where was it? You're gonna find it. Yeah, so... So, yeah, just type that whole thing in and, you know, that's how I'll do it and we'll see what he declared. Because I don't... Maybe... My guess is he's gonna say, he said that they just only wanted to play. Because that one that was talking, I think he was the youngest one. And there was a moment in the movie near the end where he said, No, we don't, don't, don't kill me. I, we just wanted to play. And uh, I think that's what he said here. But I'm not sure, I'll Google it. So, this movie... I don't even... <sighs> okay. First half was so slow. Ugh. Ugh. I thought I was gonna fall asleep, actually. Then... At the second half... Uh, it, you know, it's sped up and... I liked it better, but I don't know, I, I don't think I enjoyed this movie. It was so short, and also, I guess it was based on real events, so that's interesting. I want to know real story, how it happened, what happened. But yeah, like I said, first half was so slow, I just, I went to sleep. Second half was better, but it wasn't that much better. It it didn't redeem first part. I don't know. Would I suggest it to someone? Maybe. It's not a bad movie. It's definitely not a bad movie. I'm just saying that first half was very boring and second half was okay. So, overall, half boring, half okay movie. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't even know. And there were no explanation. Those kids were just... I don't know. Like I said, first five days of a week, we go to school. But when Saturday and Sunday comes, oh, that's when the real stuff starts. We go and kill people. And it looks like... Okay. Maybe only four of them survived? Those four that we saw get into a bus? No, more. Wait, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. This movie, it's just... I'll never watch this again in my life. But like I said, uh, who knows? It's not the bad... It's not a bad movie to suggest to other people. And I guess being this short is good, because... There is no way you can stretch this plot. It already felt so stretched because most of the time there were nothing happening, so <laughs> yeah. And it doesn't have a happy ending like most of the movies, so that's also a good thing. So yeah, that's enough. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Tell me in the comments below what you want me to watch next. 
what how I do it is like half of the suggestions are from you guys and my friends and other half are from whatever I decide to do and this was not suggested by anyone so maybe that's why I was disappointed because I picked this movie myself I was looking for some short horror movie and it's not Rack and it's not Blair Witch and it's not Host or Dumb or any, any other horror movie we watched yeah thank you for watching hope you enjoyed it and guys i'll see you in the next one goodbye